If you're anything like me, you love drinking Cokes or root beer or whatever out of a glass bottle. It just tastes better, but the pop-off lids don't pop off very easily. So that's why we're gonna create these bottle openers. This has a leather strap. You can hang it on a grill or you can hang it in your outdoor kitchen area. You can put it on display in your kitchen or just put it in the drawer if you want to. But these things look awesome and they're gonna be a ton of fun to create. So I've gone ahead and cut up a couple of strips of oak and a strip of black walnut. And I'm gonna go ahead and glue these together using Tight Bond 3. Since this is a bottle opener, it's definitely gonna be around ice and water and drinks. And so we're just gonna go ahead and use the waterproof version of the Tight Bond glue. So I'm gonna go ahead and glue this up now. For the first design, I want it to have a handle that will give some leverage to open the bottle lid. So what I'm actually going to do, <clears throat> I'm going to use this circle right here. I'm just gonna outline this the best I can. Now I'm gonna take a cup that I had lying around in my shop I'm drawing this at an angle so I can get as many of these from the board as possible. I'm just trying different things. On this one, I'm not gonna do a perfect circle. I'm gonna do more of a freehand. That was terrible. I think what I'm actually gonna do, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm gonna make it look kinda like a charcuterie board almost. By the way, if you wanna check out a video on making an actual charcuterie board, then check out the video that's tagged right here. entirely too big. We have all of these drawn up. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 in one batch. Quick note on these. If you're making these to sell, which I believe these will sell extremely, extremely well, batch them out. I mean, 18, let's say you sell these for $20 a pop, $22, $25 a pop, you're almost at $400 just from this one little batch. And obviously you can see, I don't have that much material involved. So this is a great project to sell. This one inch hole that doesn't go all the way through is for the bottle opener insert. And this half inch diameter hole is going to be for the leather handle. Right here, I'm doing a little bit of sanding. I started with 80 grit and went up to 220 grit.
before we finish up these bottle openers, if I could just ask that if this video has been helpful for you, if it has inspired you to get in the shop and create something, maybe you're gonna try making these bottle openers. If you can hit the like button, it looks just like this. It's totally free and it just helps me get the video out to more people. And also, if you would like to stick around for future projects that we'll do, I have lots of um, projects I wanna take on in the near future that I think you'll enjoy if you've enjoyed this video, then hit the subscribe button. Once again, that's totally free. All it does is just makes my, e my videos easier for you to find. So I would really, really appreciate that. Thank you guys so much for supporting me. Let's keep going on this bottle opener. Take some time, make sure you orient this, uh, the bottle opening mechanism the way you like. I wouldn't over tighten these too, too much. Um, you know, once it's pretty much flush with the face of this metal, I think it will be good. Next, I'm just taking about a foot of leather cord.